There's a lot that needs to change in Destiny 2, but today we're going to talk about Sparrows, and we're going to start right now. What's up guys, Reckless here, welcome to Guardian Watcher. If it's your first time here and you enjoy learning all things about Destiny, then hit the subscribe button and click on the bell, that way you guys don't miss out on any future videos. Just so you know, the video is about Sparrows in Destiny 2, but the gameplay is from Destiny 1. So, can someone please tell me what the hell is going on with Sparrows, or Speeders, or whatever people call them these days. Destiny 2 has been out well over 7 months now, and we still have the same boring, reskinned sparrows. Whatever happened to trick sparrows like the tumbler sparrow from the original Destiny? Now, be honest, let me know in the comments below how many of you out there, besides myself, actually went off on your own or in a group to Mars or other planets with your trick sparrow just to go off jumps and do tricks for hours on end in the original Destiny. Now, I know I'm not the only loser out there, come on, integrity. Let me know. And the thing is, it was fun. And yeah, there was no in-game progression, but we enjoyed it anyways because having fun is what really mattered. We had Trick Sparrows in D1, so why didn't it actually carry over to D2? There's really no reason why it shouldn't already be in Destiny 2. I mean, Bungie could have made one of the 12 exotic sparrows as of this video a Trick Sparrow, but they didn't. It really just feels like Sparrows in D2 are just there for short transportation. They'll get you from A to B without the need for fast travel, but besides that, there really is no use for Sparrows. I mean, yeah, you can go off a jump and use your D-pad to do some boring tricks that were in D1, and yeah, Sparrows in D2 do have perks, but the perks that they have really aren't useful in an everyday situation. For example, what is the point of getting on your sparrow faster if you just got destroyed by ads and they continue to focus fire on your body? There is none. Some sparrows have a max speed of 150 and some have a max speed of 160 but with the same perks. There is really no reason to keep a 160 version of your sparrow then, right? I mean, the only difference between legendary sparrows and exotic sparrows is cosmetics because they pretty much have the same perks. It would be nice to have another reason to use sparrows like being able to jump off huge hills and do a trick or even SRL. Speaking of SRL, a lot of us Guardians thought that SRL was going to come back with this past dawning event and slowly but surely, we were let down. However, come May 8th, the second DLC for Destiny 2 will be released and guess where we're going back to? You guessed it, Mars. But most likely this time, we will be in a different part of Mars and many have speculated that we will be more so around Mars's ice caps. So think about it as the North Pole. However, only time will tell what is actually going to come with this DLC or we can actually find out in the reveal that Bungie plans on doing on April 24th, 2018 on Twitch. Hopefully this will introduce some cool new sparrows that we can actually use and do tricks on as well as new areas to not only explore but to also do some crazy tricks. But wait, there's more. Come summer 2018, we will be seeing a new seasonal event in Destiny 2. Now, given that there is really one major holiday in the summer, we can only assume that Independence Day will be the theme. There is a possibility that SRL may come back with this event. It's like you'll be racing for your freedom. And it kind of makes sense given that we are going to get private matches on May 8th. Now, if SRL doesn't come back in the summer, then yeah. I'd be a little disappointed, but I'll still live. It's very, very heavy wishful thinking. Let me know in the comments if you guys would like SRL to come back in Destiny 2, or if you would care less if it comes back at all. One thing to note is that it is very clear to the Destiny community that Bungie is trying to bring back all of the things that we loved in the original Destiny to Destiny 2. It just sucks that it's happening over a long period of time. But in the end, it's good that Bungie takes these chances now to find out what the community does and does not enjoy. That way the franchise will be able to grow in the right direction. Trick Sparrows and SRL, it'll be back. When? Don't know. It's only a matter of time. But hopefully it's sooner rather than later. 
I know that this was a short video, but if you guys have any thoughts on what needs to change in Destiny 2, then let me know in the comments and I just might feature your topic in another video. And if you enjoyed this video, then feel free to watch these videos as well. You never know, you just might like them. And if you do, leave a like, share them, and then come back for more, because you know you want to. Thank you guys for watching, and remember, less guns doesn't mean less crime. And I will see you guys next time.